Hello Mouseworks fans and welcome to another edition of Mouseworks in the Box Reviews. And for this episode I'm going to be reviewing a Mini Arts wooden barrels. This one right here. And basically they make two sets. These just came out. They did have an older set but they were uh, uh, mixed with some other materials and they only had one barrel in them. So anyways they make this one which I believe is a medium and then they have a, one with small barrels. So, um, we'll take a look at that and see what's in there. Uh, be sure to hit the subscribe button right down there and the uh, bell so you get up the updates and uh, information that I've got some new videos coming up. And that way I can get you some information and help you in your modeling. So, let's take a look at these uh, barrels. Alrighty. I was kind of surprised and uh, excited about this uh, set of barrels. Mini Art makes a lot of different little accessory sets which is really nice. They're one of the only companies that's really gone crazy with uh, little diorama parts and uh, this one I was excited for because it was a set of uh, wine and beer barrels that nobody has done before. So let's take a look at this. box is very beautiful. I mean really nice looking and uh, they show some of the other stuff on the other side and then on the back is actually the assembly instructions so since it's so simple you don't really have to you don't have to include any instructions and they got some color charts here with Vallejo, Mr. Color, AK Real Colors which is nice, Mission Models, Mig Ammo, Tamiya and uh, the color name so that's really nice that they do that all those different manufacturers so let's pop the box open and see what we got And there's what they are. <laughs> They're always a little smaller than I think at 35th scale on when I get one of these detail sets. So let's take a quick look inside the package. They give you 12 barrels total. Uh, some different sizes here. So pull them out. Okay. So you got three, uh, six brews of the same thing. So. Okay, so let's take a quick look. Let's uh, zoom in a little bit here. Let's see if we can get a better view here. Okay. So it looks like uh, on this side you've got the barrel ends. Uh, four small, two big. And uh, some spigots, which are really nicely done. I mean, it's mini art quality. I mean, that's just really nice. Alright, flipping it over. We got the barrels. And they're looking really good. They got the little rivets and where the bands come over each other, so that's really nicely detailed. They even have the little notches between the stakes, which is really nice, so they don't look uh, like they're just all even and perfectly done, because no, no barrel actually is. Uh, that's the other thing, is these actual the stakes uh, and the ribs in the barrels are actually different thicknesses, which is how barrels are made. They actually fit them um, with what stock they have, they are never exactly the same. So uh, those look pretty good. The only uh, drawback is that they do not have any wood grain, but uh, wood grain would be pretty fine on them since they are not rough wood. Um, so doing the oil paint technique uh, for streaking the wood might actually be better without actual wood grain. Plus, we can always put in wood grain ourselves. Uh, these ones, the small ones, have a little bung on the one side of them and then the other side of this which is interesting there's actually double sided you can use either one but this side has an actual hole for the spigot um, plus if you want to have a barrel open you can have, have that sitting there and you'd have both sides have detail on them so anyways then these are the little uh, cask uh, holders and they uh, they're a little bit rough we need probably to make them look like wood just a little scraping with a a fine tooth saw. So, anyways, uh, really excited about this, and uh, they look really nice. And it would be kind of nice to uh, take one of these. My idea was to take one of these and put it under the wing of a Spitfire because there was a famous incident where they brought some uh, alcohol to some of the uh, uh, aerodromes um, on a wing of a Spitfire. Very famous. So, it'd be almost nice to use one of these on the under wing of one of those so being 35th 32nd close enough and like I said you get enough to do 12 barrels so 
really enjoying this one. I'm going to build these up. I'm going to scrape them, probably try to get the grain in there, just find the grain and paint them up, maybe in a future video. So thanks for watching.